Hey everybody, in this video tutorial I'm gonna show you how to add ChatGPT as a sidebar to any website or to your Chrome web browser. So as you can see I'm reading a Wikipedia article and I have opened up this ChatGPT sidebar. You can do this by first installing a Chrome extension called ChatGPT Sidebar, which now also supports GPT-4 for GPT Plus users. And all you have to do is basically add it to Google Chrome or any kind of Chromium-based browser. So it also works on Microsoft Edge. I will also link it in the description below. And once you install the extension, once you are any kind of website, you're gonna see this extension icon here. So if you click on it, this will open up this ChatGPT Sidebar. And as you can see, you can not only ask questions to it, but as you can see here, there are multiple pre-made ChatGPT prompts that you can use. For instance, in this case, I have used the rewrite prompt and I had the part of this Wikipedia article about financial engineering. And as you can see, the ChatGPT has started to rewrite the article. There are some great prompts here. So you can see, for instance, there is one called similar pages. In this case, this GPT ChatGPT sidebar will try to find 10 similar pages, which is related to the URL you are currently on. So related to this financial engineering Wikipedia article. So if I click on submit, it will try to find 10 similar pages related to financial engineering. So as you can see, it will add the name of or the title of the page and the exact URL. So you can check out the quantitative finance page, the mathematical finance page, computational finance page, and many more. So I stopped generating now, but let's see some other examples. You can use it to explain codes, rewrite an article you are checking out. You can also use it for translation, for grammar uh, mistakes, to check grammar mistakes, to summarize web pages. Or you can also select the custom prompt and then you can basically ask the ChatGPT anything, then click on submit and it will write you a ChatGPT response and you don't have to open up your ChatGPT account for this to work. Yeah, so all in all, this is how to use ChatGPT in a browser sidebar using this ChatGPT sidebar Chrome extension.